nobody so far has gone to any of the islands off Donegal. MBI is the first to provide the service. MBI are delivering high-speed fibre broadband to every corner of the country and the islands are no exception. It's extremely challenging. It's all weather permitting, tidal permitting. We have to charter boats to bring materials on the island. There's no roads, footpaths, anything. It's basically grass, fields, if there's part of the fields or over rocks. Today we are on the island of Rutland. From start to finish in Rutland Island, it would take approximately two months from start to finish. Get all the materials over, stand in the pole, erecting the cabinets. Once that's done, then we start tracking around the whole island to all the houses and all the premises, each individually. Having high-speed broadband on the islands today is a game-changer. Each premises on the islands will be connected directly with a fibre connection, delivering the same speeds available on the mainland today. The people on the islands are so friendly. A lot of people I've spoken to would actually work here full-time and live full-time if they had fibre to the premises. I had the grand idea of living off, off the Fatherland, getting away from the city, kind of living more self-sufficiently, but I still had to work. So when I found out the internet was connected and the broadband was there, I was kind of like, okay, this is feasible. Having the high-speed broadband eased any anxieties about moving here and it kind of was like, allowed me to kind of have some sort of connection to the outside world and also to keep working, keep earning money. When you're having the discussion about wanting to work remotely or wanting to move to a remote island off the coast of Donegal, one of the first questions they have is like, is there phone reception and is there broadband? And I'm like, there's fiber fiber broadband. And I think it's probably better than you have in your house or in your office. Broadband is just like completely flawless, hasn't crashed at all. Everything loads straight away, things upload straight away. There's no buffering on the stream. It means I can afford to uh, work less. I'm not paying mental rent like I was in Dublin. So it gives me, you know, between not having to commute, not worrying about buses, it just gives me the headspace to kind of live the life that I want to live. If it wasn't for the high-speed broadband, I would still be in Dublin probably, yeah, tearing my hair out. I love this island so much, it was such an important part of my childhood and it's just amazing that I can be able to live here now.